Hey guys. So after watching that episode of Chopped, uh, that's a show on Food Network, we are going to do an art chopped. Okay. So just like on their show, you are going to divide up into teams uh, and you each get a basket of items that you have to create with. So here are the rules. You do have to create a work of art. Uh, it can be flat, it can be a 3D piece, so either sculpture, weaving, painting, drawing, a combination of a ton of different stuff. Uh, and you do have to include all of the items in your basket. Our baskets are just brown paper bags today, uh, and they contain a pipe cleaner, a toilet paper roll, and a tongue depressor. It doesn't matter how you choose to use those in your work, but they have to be present somewhere. Uh, other rules, everyone has to participate. So me or the substitute, whoever happens to be in charge today, uh, is going to divide you up into teams. There are going to be six teams. Each member of your team has to do something to help make the artwork. But guys, work to your strength. So if one person is really, really good at drawing, Maybe have them do all the drawing part. If somebody else has really creative ideas, maybe have them be the thinker, making up the ideas, coming up with the plan. So you figure out what that looks like. Uh, after you guys get divided into groups, you're going to have 20 minutes to come up with your work of art. It can be anything you want. Um, and then at the end of 20 minutes, you are going to have your judge right here uh, vote on the top two artworks out of the six then those two will get to face off for the championship uh, and I will have a prize for the group that is the winner. So um, here are the, your tools. So every table has to have those particular things in from the basket used in their artwork. I'm also going to have you have some different tools at your tables. You got glue, you got a glue stick, there's scissors for everybody. Uh, you also have tape and a ruler. So you do have some different things to help you out along your way. I also have a uh, art supply store, just like they have a pantry. So if you take a look really quick over behind me on the cart, we do have pastels, we have markers, and we have watercolor paints. Uh, I also have pencils up there. And then on the table are all colors and kinds of different scrap papers. So you've got a ton of stuff to help you come up with some creative ways to make this work. Okay. Alrighty. So let's get started and have fun guys. 